and going back across to our correspondent Anas Malik who is with us from Kiev. Uh, Anas, uh, tell us more about what things are looking like on the ground. Uh, we were looking at visuals coming in earlier of how citizens were lining up outside the grocery sto stores uh, before that curfew was put in place. Uh, there are growing concerns over supplies running out as well. Well, uh, Molly, the situation on the ground it remains grim and tense. Uh, we've seen the Ukrainian Ministry of Defense putting out a statement as per their intelligence estimates that uh, Russia is sending reinforcements, especially through the sea as well, and that it is it is now deploying Pacific Fleet uh, as a reinforcement uh, for uh, uh, for its fleet that is there on the sea near in the Black Sea. Now, uh, coming back to the situation here in the city of Kiev, well, it's been almost. Uh, 20 hours since the city has been under curfew. The curfew is to last for another uh, 13 plus hours uh, uh, and uh, it will get off tomorrow morning at 7. Now, I'll just get aside. Uh, it's not that it was not a ghost town previously, but uh, uh, the city actually uh, is empty and you can probably see as well that uh, uh, this uh, uh, this is a busy road This and the other side is uh, uh, is, is a prominent uh, uh, square. It's, uh, it's the center of the city. That's just empty. Only people with special accreditation passes have been allowed to go out, venture out, and uh, 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 that's it. Uh, journalists were asked to not uh, uh, step out despite the fact that they had accreditation from uh, the uh, uh, armed forces of Ukraine. They were asked not to step out. So this this site uh, tells the story itself. Uh, now, why was the curfew imp uh, imposed at the first place? There are a lot of speculations, but uh, given that the Ukrainian side has not come out in the open, and clarified as to why the uh, why the curfew was imposed. That is, uh, it's leading to a lot of anxiety. Some say that it is because that Russia wants to uh, wanted to do more and more attacks. Some say it was to uh, against the uh, uh, operation against uh, saboteurs or Russian facilitators. Some say it was because of security concerns. Out of security concerns, given that uh, the three prime ministers were in town. So lots of speculations are there uh, over there and. As I said, uh, in the absence of clarity from the government, there is some anxiety because of it. We are now 